Every Dolly Parton song, I'm gonna say nine to five, and the other one's gonna be Jolene, because I went to one of Dolly's shows, uh, I believe in LA, and uh, I just fell in love with her and her storytelling. What makes Dolly such a relatable songwriter is she, is she writes what she lives and she writes what she knows. Working nine to five, like anybody can relate to those songs, um, and she does a great job on selling them and singing them. Dolly Parton's legacy, in my opinion, is just, it's huge. Um, not only is she Dolly Parton, but she also has the wonderful Dollywood that I love. I love Gatlinburg. When I go to Gatlinburg, I just, I'm going to Dolly's town, basically. Um, and she's just amazing. I, I, I've been close to her ranch before, all of her horses. She's just, her legacy is huge. And it's not going to stop anytime soon. Hey, Kane, I'm glad you like Dollywood. So do I. You keep coming. You know I need the money. You know, my favorite line is, it costs a lot to look this cheap. Anyway, talking about nine to five, I'm glad you like that one. You no, know, I wrote that on my fingernails. Working nine to five, what a way to make a living. Anyway, that little song has just been the gift that keeps on giving. Of course, we had the movie nine to five. It was a number one hit, of course, and I was very, very proud of that. And uh, so I did a, a Broadway musical been 40 years as you know and it's still going we're still it's traveling around different parts of the world as a musical and it's been like I can't believe it's been that long that I did that little movie with Jane Fonda and Lily Tomlin